Art can be really fun. It doesn't have to just be a canvas, you know? There's plenty of other ways to look at art and appreciate art and enjoy art. And I knew that tying artists in with the bikes would be the perfect blend of art meets action sports. I want people to go in there, be able to look at a piece of art, but also be able to experience an activation and then see a guy flying on a motorcycle, you know, 30 feet in the air. It was just an idea, like a really good one. Four bikes, four artists, two locations. There's a lot of variables that were out of my control and I did the best I could to control them, to keep my cool, keep my team cool, and get to where I needed to go and make the show happen. I was excited. Miami Design District is like, uh, that sounds dangerous. Like really, really dangerous. And I'm like, it is. It's very dangerous. Think about it. It's a scaffold down two ramps and then you have an an inflatable zero impact landing, two of them. So you have two takeoffs, two landings. And then you have no net to catch you. So that means if you fly off that wall, that's it. Like nobody thought the show was gonna happen. Nobody thought the permits were gonna go through. And they emailed me back and they said, let's do it. I'll clear up, I just haven't talked about it. <laughs> Damn. I really cared that much. like yo it's kind of like move on to the next like like move on bro get over the show you're not the, the Miami Design District doesn't want you jumping motorcycles on the top of the, the garage it's just it is what it is but I just didn't give up <laughs>